Hello, people. Today I have another 30 Minute Sisters option part set. This is set number four, Stealth Armor. Now, this one was designed uh, with Rochetta's in mind, but you can use that on any of the other armors. Uh, all of the other 30 Minute Missions kits should be at least partially compatible. It's just this one is mostly designed for this one here. It gives you directions for it. Three millimeter ports all around, of course, mean that you can plug them into almost anything. Uh, so you do have ports and pegs. So you'll be able to plug that in anywhere that also has ports and pegs. Now this Ruchetta in particular is using her um, option body number one. Uh, so you can see uh, that is the nice color that combines pretty well with the stealth armor. It does flow really nicely in terms of color, I think. Uh, you can see that slightly darker tone uh, doesn't exactly match that, but it's not bad in terms of uh, what you get out of the box. And I bet you that if I didn't tell you, you probably wouldn't have noticed there was much of a difference. Uh, Eagle-eyed people probably would, but I didn't at first. And then I kept looking closer and saying, that's not exactly the same. But uh, whatever the case is, it doesn't look bad. Uh, in terms of color matching. Of course, you can always fix that with paint. Not that I'm going to, probably just going to leave these parts as is. But as you can see here, and as I did mention, this is uh, mostly meant for Rochetta. You can see here how the uh, parts combine with her massive claw. Her shoulder armor also hooks up to that one almost directly, just like the uh, speed armor type. So you can see that it is meant to be uh, in particular with this set. But like I said, you do have options available. This one is unlike the speed armor. It's just by itself. So you are able to remove that just like so. No need for another part underneath. Now, as you can see here with the speed armor, uh, there are some differences. I think the speed armor actually includes more than the stealth armor does. But that said, I think with the tail section and the big ears there, I think this is a nice selection of goodies to uh, augment your 30 minute sister. And in fact, it does show that you can mix and match these parts with the speed armor or the default armor on Rochetta. And also you can use these really cool swords uh, which you can't do with the speed armor. Now, the claw is, of course, going to be in the way. Move that out of the way. And now you have her sword. And it does come with two of those. So you are capable of doing that anytime you'd like. Now, obviously, there's not a lot to say about this particular set. It is a nice armor set that plugs into the available ports on this one. So uh, there are lots of available options, too. Uh, customize this the way you'd like. As you see here, you can uh, flip this one around. Maybe do it this way instead of downward. Uh, you can put these in any other slot or position that you might think it would be fitting in. You know, something like this. Uh, it would work with your 30 minute missions kits as well because they are 30, uh, 3 millimeter ports and pegs. Uh, so you can do that. And of course, you can pop and swap these as you'd like. You know, you want to put a couple of these on, it would be pretty cool. And the, the price itself, I think, was a little high for what you get at um, $10.99. I think you can get better options out there. I personally do think the Speed Armor had a little bit more going for it, but I do like this set a lot, and I actually plan on getting more because these V's here, I really like the way they look, and I have an idea on how to use them. So, um, cannibalizing these things isn't terribly expensive, but it is something to consider when you're uh, purchasing these kinds of things. It might not be worth purchasing multiples of. But like I did mention before, it is able to be used with any of the other 30 Minute Missions available, or any of the 30 Minute Sisters, so feel free to mix and match as you would like. But I think that's all I'm going to go ahead and cover today. Uh, there isn't a lot, like I said, to this. Uh, there isn't any blurb or write-up about it. It simply is what it is, just like the other option 
option part. So um, it's not an over the top. It's not anything flashy. It is just the stealth armor. And the, the color matches really well with this body set. So if you want to make a custom girl in that color tone, you have more options available for it. But with that said, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. I will see you guys next time, or you'll see me, but more than likely, you'll see my stuff. Bye-bye.